Fire has destroyed a Comox Valley landmark. Flames tore through the Lorne Hotel overnight. The hotel had the distinction of being one of the oldest licensed establishments in British Columbia, pouring its first pint in 1878, and a lot has happened there since then. Tonight, a burnt-out shell is all that remains, along with decades of fond memories. A News reporter Gord Kerbis has the story. When fire crews first arrived, there was just thick black smoke, but within moments, flames began taking over a Comox Valley landmark. We started an interior inside attack, and re the conditions deteriorated, so we moved to the outside and we were doing an outside attack. The rest of the fire department showed up, uh, 30 firefighters and three major uh, vehicles. Crews began their efforts just after 2 a.m., but it would prove to be a losing battle. They were trying to control the fire, which was quickly consuming the Lauren Hotel, built back in 1878, long before sprinkler systems. On the second floor, there was a lot of storage items, you know, uh, memorabilia, you know, stuff from uh, neon lights and stuff like that. So that could have been given off some of that uh, black smoke and different colored smoke on that. The Lorne was the Comox Valley's first hotel and was seen as an important fixture in the community. Amongst the handful of those watching it burn in the early hours was Bob Wilson. Ever since I came here in uh, 1976, this was the uh, first place I went after work. Go for a beer. They've been going here a long time. I met my uh, partner there 30 years ago. We used to go there and play pool back when we were like in our 20s. And there's some pretty interesting characters that used to hang out there, like older people, which are all gone now. And now also gone is the hotel itself. This morning, all that remained was a smoldering pile of rubble. One Comox town councillor says a big part of the community has disappeared. It's not a good thing for our town, you know. We've, that, that's a building that everybody sort of really liked around our town and, and uh, really added some character to our main street. So. It's a big loss. Do you have any personal memories? Oh, none that I'd want to say on camera. <laughs> but I don't think you can grow up in the Comox Valley and not have some personal memories in the Lauren Hotel. I've um, been there on a few occasions, and uh, but mostly I just felt happy that it was there. You know, it was um, very much a, a landmark in the in the town, and um, I think it'll be sorely missed. Just even as that, even if you didn't use it. The town's mayor is trying to see a silver lining in the tragedy. We're um, very sad to see it lost, a total loss to the fire. Uh, we really feel for the staff that worked there. We're very thankful that there was no one hurt, no firefighters hurt. Once the site cools, insurance adjusters and fire inspectors are expected to go through the rubble to try to see if there's any hope of determining a cause. In Comox, Gord Curvis, A News.